transformed into a human by an experimental witch's spell. A young, voiceless frog was launched into an unfamiliar world. She had to travel and collect fragments of her voice that had been scattered by the spell to become fully human. Fragments of her voice could be located and gathered as long as she sang, but her voice had a limited range. The nameless frog had to go places no frog had gone before to gather all the pieces of her voice. After traveling and performing in different lands and oceans, the girl discovered outer space. She and her sidekick, Ribs, traveled through space and encountered a black hole. They miraculously survived, but as a result, she was pulled apart into two separate bodies. The new body formed its own personality and called herself Toady, while the original body called herself Froggy. Toady embodied the dark and vile side of Froggy. Toady was cunning, while Froggy was naive. Toady only cared for profit, while Froggy tried to help others out of kindness. Froggy was not aware of Toady's existence and carried on into the cyber world in search of her voice. Toady knew she was the darkness to Froggy's light. She was ambitious and vowed to overshadow Froggy by getting her voice first. The combination of the black hole and the witch's spell granted Toady mystical powers. She could dive into the dreams of others, conjure oh. lightning, and control Froggy's Psh body when she was sleeping. Toady slowly stole each piece of Froggy's voice. Once completed, Toady revealed herself to Froggy and pushed her back down the pond where she came from, undoing the witch's spell. Feeling lost and defeated, a frog once more, Froggy wandered aimlessly. Blue Arpeggio Park was the most peaceful place that calmed Froggy's anxieties. It was where she met her idols. They listened to her problems and encouraged her to keep going towards her goals. They gave her a music box that could put anything to sleep. Froggy decided she needed help to conquer Toadie. She met a wise bird named Bonsai, who advised her to accept the other side of herself rather than to fight it. She made friends of Cheesecake, the Corgi, who promised to help her in exchange for a song written about him. Then Froggy rode on her new beloved mount, Cheesecake, who sniffed out Toadie's castle. Ribs and Bonsai helped Froggy sneak inside. She used the music box to put everyone in the castle to sleep, including herself. Because Froggy and Toadie's dreams were linked, Froggy found Toady and consumed her bit by bit until they finally awoke as one person again. No longer completely Froggy, not quite Toady either, a new singer was born. <laughs>